Welcome back to Top 5 Auto Repairs. How do you know you have a bad torque converter? The torque converter is located inside the transmission bell housing and it is mounted on the input shaft. When the torque converter is failing, the driver is going to notice all sorts of symptoms. The first common symptom that you know that your torque converter is failing is going to be shuddering. When you are driving and it feels like your vehicle is shuddering, that could be a sign that your torque converter is failing. Shuddering feels like you're driving on a gravel road or a very bumpy road. That's going to be shuddering. How do you know shuddering is caused by a bad torque converter? And this is how you check it. When you're driving and when your vehicle starts to shudder, keep your foot on the gas pedal and maintain pressure on the gas pedal. Afterward, lightly tap on the brake pedal. If the shutter stops, that means this is going to be caused by a bad torque converter. The next sign that you know that your torque converter is failing is going to be slipping. If you're driving and it feels like your vehicle is slipping between gears, again, that's going to be caused by a failing torque converter. The next sign that you know that your torque converter is failing is going to be you're going to get some sort of transmission code such as P0741. When you're getting torque converter codes, that means the transmission control module noticed there's an issue with the torque converter and it's going to trigger that code P0741. That means the TCC slip RPM or number is way off. Most likely it is extremely high. Again, that's going to trigger torque converter codes. The next time that you know that your torque converter is failing is you're going to hear some sort of noise coming from the bell housing. If you're hearing a whirring noise or a whining noise, that means the torque converter internal components are failing and the torque converter is on its way out. When the torque converter internal components are wearing out, it can send metal shavings into the transmission and that can cause the transmission to prematurely fail. So when you see metal shaving inside your transmission, you must immediately flush out your transmission and change the transmission fluid and change the transmission filter and it is possible you can save your transmission. However, you still need to change your torque converter. If you see transmission fluid coming out of the bell housing area, this is going to be caused by a bad torque converter seal. When you're losing transmission fluid, this can definitely cause an overheating condition. I hope you found this video useful. As always, thank you for watching and subscribe to Top 5 Auto Repairs.